hi guys in this video i will show you how to generate random numbers so to do to display random number let me just uh, define a label here so generated random number is So here uh, we will display our random number. So if I go to the TypeScript file, I will just declare that variable here. Sorry. So random number can be generated uh, using math dot random function. Which is a JavaScript function. I will assign the result to the random number variable. So if I reload the app, you can see the generated random number here. So what I can do is uh, I will just add another button here. So whenever user clicks that button, it will generate new random number. I will just call it as a gen random. And I will close the button here. Let me random number. So I will define this function at the type script and I will put this call here. So when I click on random number, it will generate a random number. If I again click, it will generate different number. So in many cases, we don't want a random number from zero to one. Uh, by default, this random dot floor call, which is a JavaScript function, will generate a random number from zero to one. So if you need a random number from zero to some other maximum value, let's say ten we can generate that by multiplying the this random number by 10 so if i click it here it will generate some random number from 0 to 10 but this is a floating point value right if you need an integer value so you can use another two calls which are math dot floor so which is a floor floor is behind you right so if i get like uh, 9.4 it will be given to 9 So that is a floor. If we are using seal, the 9.4 will be converted to 10. This is floor. This is seal. So right now we are using floor. You can see only integers are generated. If you wanna see without flow call, let me just add it here. This dot raw random number. 
equal to I'll just put it I put it here shall I put it here so I'll just replace this with this dot ram random number so I'll just define this thing here and I will change this name to floor sorry to seal so I'll just change this to flow So I'll just I'll, I'll quickly add three labels here. So random number floor is that one. Seal is this one. That will be replaced with the floor. This will be replaced with seal. This will be replaced with no uh, uh, raw random number, so I'll just put it as random number. So if I save it, oh, it is reloading. If I click it here, get random is not a function. Right. Just reload it again. You can see here the value is 7.5, the floor value is 7 and the ceiling is 8. If you want to generate a random number between two values, for example take variable maximum value, maximum v is 10, variable minimum v is 5. So you can generate like this so maximum max v minus minimum v plus minimum v so i will save and run again you can see here the generated value will always be between five and ten thanks for watching for more videos please subscribe to my channel